You must be the boy king. Edmund. And you must be the leader of the Vikings we've been hearing for days and smelling for a week. My name is King Canute. And I have come to kill you for the crimes your father committed against my people. Well, I hate to disappoint you, but it is you who will pay the price for your crimes. Such brave words from a boy hiding behind the wall. Where I come from, we have a word for that. Play that! <laughs> And what does that mean? It means... <laughs> Coward! And it is your new title! <laughs> King Flavor! Why not come out? Like a man, King. And do battle with honor. Honor? What honor is there in sweeping the field clear of a rabble hungry only for Dane Geld? You are no better than the beggars at my gate! I must say, I, I am disappointed in your response. What has become of England? There used to be warriors here. Your father, for example. When I was your age, I saw King Athelred lead a hundred men against a thousand. How he must anguish in his grave, knowing that he has sired a mouse for a son. I will make you a challenge. Come down here and fight me, man to man, king to king. Or if you wish, bring whatever troops you choose and fight my men on this magnificent bridge. If you are victorious, then we will know that our quest was not endorsed by God. We will accept his decision and leave this land without further bloodshed. But if you do not, I promise you, all the world will know the truth about Edmund, son of Athelred. How he sacrificed the courage of his kingdom to hide his own fear. And they will join us in hailing King Blaver, the coward of London. I am not a coward! <laughs> Come back here! I order you! Get me my horse! <laughs> <laughs>